Hello. Well, this is episode seven, and um, this is about um, how many legs does a turkey have and at Thanksgiving. I was shooting a film, a uh, television commercial with an advertising agency, a very big one, and there's a problem with advertising agencies. When uh, people get fired in film companies and they lose their job, they go directly to the advertising companies and get hired to uh, work with the advertiser to produce television commercials. So frequently, if you're a film guy like I am, or video guy, whatever you want to say, um, you, you end up with these guys who are in charge of the production for the advertising agency who are pretty crazy, like my friend, <laughs> you know, I was telling you about before, Sky Hires in episode six. Um, and he's, I mean, Sky Hires, is a, he was an okay guy. He was a fun guy. It was interesting. But I got a real jerk on uh, a commercial I was making uh, for Thanksgiving. And what we were doing was, um, it was a food commercial. And if you're a cameraman, uh, the secret to making a good food commercial is that when people watch your commercial, they get hungry and they go out and they buy the product, buy the food. So the trick in food photography is to use lighting to make the food look really good and really tasty. So you can see all of the juices and all that, you know, so yummy, right? So we were doing that with this turkey. And so, uh, it was, you know, to get people to go buy turkey at a local store or whatever. So we start filming, right? And I film the thing, and uh, I shoot, uh, you know, as we're carving up the turkey. I, sh uh, sh you know, shot the whole thing. And uh, work right, right? And then um, we go into the editing room, you know, the next day, and I'm editing this film with this advertising guy. And the advertising guy said, we need a really good close-up shot of, you know, or a good shot of cutting the, the, the leg off the turkey. You know, you do that first, and then you, then you begin to cut the white meat, and so on and so forth. And, uh, and I said, okay, fine. And so I showed him that the, there were two shots, right? Because turkeys have two legs, right? Not for an advertising guy who's incompetent, which this guy was. He wanted to use, he asked me if we could use the third shot. And I said, the, the third shot. He said, yeah, the third shot. And I, he said, show it to me. I need to see one more shot. We've seen two. I don't like either one of them. So show me the third shot, and maybe we can use that one. And, of course, there, is, there was no third shot, right? Common sense. But these guys don't have that quality. So... Uh, I thought about it a while, and what I did is I showed him the first shot again, because that was the better one of the two, and, uh, and he said, okay, well, thank you, I prove it, and I went, fine, yeah, okay, good, so we used the first shot, but for the advertising guy, it was the third shot, right, so for him, turkeys have three legs, <laughs> so these are the kind of people you have to deal with when you're in the film business. And, uh, and, and they're paying for what you're doing, so you have to kind of listen to them and, and deal with them as best as you can. So I thought you might like to hear that story. It was my, one of my favorite film editing stories. Okay, so uh, that's, that's it for today. And um, you see my cup of coffee here. And uh, I did get a cup of coffee, actually, from... Yeah, you know, somebody bought me one yesterday. So this one is paid for. Okay, so anyway, that's uh, my film story for a film editor. Film editing is really the most difficult thing, in a way, because it's where you make the story, you put it together, and uh, the editor can make or break a film, right? Uh, yes, cameras are important, and lighting is important, all of that, yeah. But if you want to tell a good story, you have to know how to edit, and you have to make, what you, make the film work with the shots you have. That's the secret of a good film editor, and it's a very difficult job. So anyway, okay, so that's it for today.